This is the second date update on the 10 with Ramiro, Pebbles, and Melissa, the Get Up Crew. Hot 96.9. Hey, Kimberly. Hello. Good hello, morning. Hello, hello. What's up, girl? How you doing? We're doing great. So this is an actual second date update because you only went on one date with this guy, Ronald? Yes. Beautiful. Mm. Okay. I mean, it sucks that he's not getting back to you after one date, but it's just, it's good that we're trying to get a second date out. of So what happened on the first date? Yeah, well, um, so we met online, and we did the chatting back and forth, and then we finally decided to meet up, Mm -hmm. and I thought the date was super cool. You know, we had some good food, great conversation, but ever since that night, he hasn't gotten back to me. Now, he did say that he was going away for a week on a business trip, but that he would get back to me, but that was like three weeks ago. Oh. Oh. It's a long time. Yeah. Hmm. Um, Yeah. Maybe his trip got extended. Maybe. Oh, and there's no phones where he's at? <laughs> maybe. Okay, well, let's recap the date. Let's, what maybe would, if he were to be like, nah, I'm out, I, this did not go well, what do you think might have happened that you might have done or maybe accidentally said or, you know, something like that? So I'm, you know, I am kind of shy around new people. Yeah. And it started kind of slow. I don't think I did or said anything, but maybe he thought I wasn't fully into him. Oh, I see. I see what you're saying. Oh, that may, you know, maybe, he, yeah, maybe he was just like, I don't know. She's, she was, I didn't think she was feeling me. Kimberly, stay quiet. We'll try and give him a call for you right now, okay? Okay. All right. Hello, this is Ronald. Ronald, uh, this is um, Romero, Pebbles, and Melissa. We're calling you from Hot 96.9, the radio station. Can I explain to you um, real quickly why we're calling? It's actually for a good reason. I'm sorry. Is this about a recent order that I put in? <laughs> no. It's not. It's about... Um, it's a, Okay, so let me explain it slowly. So we're calling you from a radio station because a girl that you know likes you she feels like you guys have a chemistry and she'd like to go on a date with you so basically if you and i'm going to tell you her name if you say yes to the date we will let you select the day the time the place all that stuff and we'll pay for it and you guys just go on a date and see if you hit it off Uh, i don't know who's the girl it's a girl who knows you're busy. So again, like we'll let you select you we'll let you create the schedule. Her name is Kimberly. She according to her, you guys had a really good time together and she uh, it, Yeah, unfortunately I do know who you're talking about. Yeah, you told her you were going away for a week for work and that you'd get back to her when you returned, but that it's been over 3 weeks and she hasn't res- received any texts or calls from you. Yeah, no, I I that was on purpose. I I don't oh. uh, <laughs> Wanna... What did she do? She said that the date was fine, that she was a little shy in the beginning, and then you guys loosened up and had a great time. Oh, okay. Is that what she said? Um, no, no, that's not it at all. I like shy. Mm-hmm. But unfortunately, she wasn't shy with my boys. What? Ooh. Your boys were on the date, too? <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. So, yeah, I've been away, and I was planning on hitting her up after this work trip. Mm-hmm. Uh, I sell medical supplies. She said she was in nursing school, and my dumbass just put two and two together. Thought we'd get along, but while I was away, my buddy was having a bachelor party, mm-hmm. and I tried to go because I was away, obviously. And he started sending me pictures. And here's what you're missing, man. You know, looks like a lot of fun. And of course, he had strippers at the party, and I zoomed in on some of the pictures, and I noticed, you know, some nasty. Sh- on the in the background, and it was f- her. No, way. Kimberly was one of the strippers. So she was a dancer. <laughs> she wasn't dancing, but <laughs> yes, okay. So that, that. how do you know it was her though? Right? Are like, you are sure? You? Like she has a very beautiful and distinct birthmark on her cheek. You could see it's a birthmark just, from a photo like a mile away. Come on. <laughs> it wasn't a mile away. She was just in the background. I zoomed in. Trust me, it was her. The only difference is she was wearing clothes. Oh my god! Oh my god! No. <laughs> well, well, we have Kimberly on the phone. Maybe she can confirm or uh, deny. This are is you true. kidding me? Yeah, uh, sorry, Kimberly, Kimberly. Kimberly, are you are you there? Yeah, I'm here. Yeah, you making so, a little extra cash on the side there, Kimberly? Kimberly, uh, did you uh, dance or do things at a bachelor party while he was away? Uh, yeah, I am in nursing school, and I okay. should. Okay. Why, why? Why leave that out? Why lie? 
you know, if we had gotten closer, I definitely would have told you. Um, it's something that I do to help myself get through school. It's good money. And I don't have to f- anybody. And I don't. That, that's totally cool. I don't want to shame you or anything. But you were shooting a ping pong ball out of your vagina. You're not even a regular <laughs> oh, You do like oh, boy. What? <laughs> That sounds way worse. <laughs> that sounds Wait, worse um, than what it was. This is what you <laughs> saw in the photo? <laughs> yes. No, no. The, it is photos, plural. All of them were live videos. When you hold it, you can see the white things flying out of her. No! No! No, no. 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 <laughs> Let me tell you, first of all, it makes the extra money. It is a stupid party trick but the way that it is set up i know for sure you didn't see any photos of my vagina because what happens is they set up the little table i lay on the table there's a wall right and the balls actually bounce off the wall and back nobody sees my how it works what a talent you know who else knows how it works are my friends my cousins two of my uncles i need to see a video I'm sorry, I didn't know that was your family. I was just doing a job. This could be a funny story to tell. At your wedding? Yeah, sure. Yeah. No, I mean, come on. I feel like Ronald's torn. Let's say that she you found out she did that, but it wasn't at a party with like apparently your entire family. Any OnlyFans? Yeah. Make yeah, money like, there. Would you would you uh be willing to give her another date? Listen, it, it's nothing against what you do. I just can't get over the fact that my uncle, who's a giant pervert, <laughs> saw you do all this stuff it, like before I even kissed you. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> I mean, look, your your uncle being a pervert is not my problem. <laughs> he was going to be a pervert with or without me. <laughs> you know what I mean? If you know, if you liked me, then and and you say you're not trying to shame me, then I don't see the problem. This is just my choice. I can't. I can't do this. This is the gotta, nicest. Aww. This is the nicest rejection I've ever heard for but a second. But do you? Date. But do you really <laughs> like her? Like, did you enjoy your date with her? Yes. But things change. Oh, Aww. see? <laughs> see, You're this, gonna is, miss this out. is all your friend's fault for sending you the yeah. damn pictures. And I'm putting it lightly. I'm happy he sent me the pictures. You know how embarrassing it'd be? Like, hey, meet my new girlfriend. I'm like, we already met. The second date update on the 10th. Weekday mornings at 610, 710, and 810. If you need a second date update, email us. Get up crew at hot969boston.com. <laughs> Yeah.